Hello and welcome back everyone, today we will look back at the 1996 American TV series Third Rock from the Sun. We will revisit the cast of the TV series and will find out what happened to them. I will also tell you some interesting trivia facts about the show which you probably did not know, so let's jump right into it. David DeLucy, son of the famous comedian Dom DeLucy, is an American actor best known for his role as Jerry Russo in Disney's Wizards of Waverly Place. He has also appeared in popular TV shows such as ER, Stargate SG-1, and Third Rock from the Sun, as well as movies like Robin Hood, Men in Tights and Kicking and Screaming. David is also a dedicated father and involved in charitable organizations. With his talent and compassion, David DeLucy continues to make a mark in the entertainment industry. Joseph Gordon-Levitt is a versatile American actor, filmmaker, and singer. He began his career as a child actor and has since appeared in several critically acclaimed films, including Inception and 500 Days of Summer. In addition to his artistic endeavors, he founded the online production company Hit Record and is an advocate for the LGBTQ community. Joseph Gordon-Levitt's dedication, talent, and passion are evident in every project he takes on. Jane Curtin is a celebrated American actress and comedian known for her iconic roles in TV shows like Saturday Night Live, Kate and Alley, and Third Rock from the Sun, as well as films like Coneheads and I Love You, Man. She has received multiple Emmy nominations and a Cable ACE Award, and has worked with charitable organizations such as the American Cancer Society and the Make-A-Wish Foundation. Curtin is a trailblazer for women in comedy and continues to inspire generations with her talent and dedication. Alan Cumming is a Scottish actor, singer, writer, and director who won a Tony Award for his role in Cabaret. He has appeared in films like Goldeneye and X-Men 2 and wrote his memoir Not My Father's Son. Cumming is also an advocate for LGBT rights and supports charities like the Hattrick Martin Institute. He is a talented artist and an inspiration to many. French Stewart stumbled upon the iconic Harry Squint by accident. After his first audition for the role, he indulged in some self-care with his bong and bath. His manager called the same day to request a callback, but Stewart was still feeling the effects. He returned to the audition with a different energy, and casting noticed the change. Despite this, they loved his performance, and the rest is history. Thus, Harry's distinctive squint lasted for the entire show thanks to Stewart's elevated callback. As a language model based on the GPT-3.5 architecture, I am capable of processing large amounts of text and generating human-like language. With a knowledge cutoff of 2021, I have been trained to answer a wide range of questions and provide insights on various topics. From science and technology to history and literature, I can offer valuable information and perspective on almost anything. I strive to be an effective tool for communication and learning, and I am always improving to meet the needs of my users. Lauren Graham is a successful American actress known for her role as Lorelai Gilmore in Gilmore Girls. She has also acted in films and other TV shows, and is a best-selling author. Graham has received award nominations for her talent and relatable personality. She continues to inspire others with her positive attitude. Christine Baranski is an American actress known for her work on stage, television, and film. She has won two Tony Awards and has been nominated for multiple Emmys. Baranski is a versatile actress who can excel in a wide range of roles and is also involved in philanthropic work. Her impressive body of work and impact on the entertainment industry make her a true icon in the world of acting. Bob Odenkirk is an American actor, comedian, writer, and producer known for his roles in Breaking Bad and Better Call Saul. He has also appeared in films such as The Post and Little Women. Odenkirk co-created the sketch comedy series Mr. Show with Bob and David and has received numerous award nominations throughout his career. He remains humble and respected in the industry. 
Throughout the series, the character of Dr. Solomon's student Leon was portrayed by Ian Lithgow, the son of John Lithgow. This role was a significant one for Ian Lithgow and helped him gain recognition as an actor in his own right. French Stewart is an American actor known for his distinctive voice and comedic timing. He gained recognition for his role in Third Rock from the Sun and has appeared in several films such as Clock Stoppers. He has also performed on stage and voiced characters in animated series and video games. Stewart's versatile acting skills and unique voice have made him a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Wayne Knight is a talented American actor known for his distinctive voice and comedic timing. He gained widespread recognition for his role as Newman on Seinfeld. He has appeared in numerous films and TV shows and has also lent his voice to various animated projects. Knight is also a philanthropist and actively involved in various charities. Despite his successful career, Knight remains down-to-earth and humble. He continues to be a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Roseanne Barr is an American actress, comedian, writer, and producer best known for her hit television show Roseanne. Her humor is frank and socially conscious, tackling controversial topics such as politics, race, and gender. However, Barr's career has been marred by controversy, including a racially charged Twitter incident that led to the cancellation of the Roseanne revival in 2018. Despite this, Barr remains an influential figure in comedy and television. Kristen Johnston is an American actress best known for her roles in Third Rock from The Sun and The Exes. She began her acting career in off-Broadway productions before making it big in Hollywood. Johnston is also an advocate for addiction recovery and mental health awareness. Despite her personal struggles, she remains a respected actress with a loyal fan base. Joseph Gordon-Levitt was not present in more than half of the episodes of the final season of the show as he focused on his studies at Columbia University. Despite being a former child star, he experienced feelings of fear and depression, worrying about the possibility of never being able to secure acting opportunities again. These details were shared by Joseph himself in an interview with details. John Lithgow is an acclaimed American actor with a four-decade career in film, TV, and theater. He's best known for his role in Third Rock from the Sun and has received two Oscar nominations for Best Supporting Actor. Lithgow is also a children's book author, philanthropist, and recipient of five Emmys, two Tonys, and a Golden Globe. Simbi Cali is an American actress known for her work in film and TV. She has appeared in popular shows like NYPD Blue, The Cosby Show, and films like Clockers. Cali is also a talented singer-songwriter with a soulful voice. Her work has left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry, inspiring many. Elmarie Wendell was an American actress known for her role as Mrs. Dubchek in Third Rock from the Sun. She appeared in other TV shows and films and was respected in theater. She had a vibrant personality and passed away on July 21, 2018, at the age of 89. Elmarie Wendell will always be remembered for her impressive career in the entertainment industry. Ian Lithgow is an American actor best known for his role as Leon in Third Rock from the Sun. He has also appeared in TV shows such as The Practice and Dexter and films like Raising Cain. Lithgow is an accomplished stage actor and has appeared in several Broadway productions. He is married with two children and enjoys playing guitar in his spare time. Initially signed for only seven episodes in the first season, Jane Curtin extended her stay on the show Saturday Night Live after her fifth appearance. She continued as a series regular until the end of the show. This decision proved to be a wise move for her career.